conference a, a facilitated process that um, bring together six to twelve people to write a book in three to five days. And it's a, it's a very intense collaborative process. It's, it seems to be all about the book, but actually it's like it's leveraging the book to get people to learn to collaborate with each other and also um, produce um, knowledge together. So um, it's not, in a way, it's kind of not about producing a book at all. It was developed so it could rapidly produce free documentation about free software because there wasn't a lot of this material. But really in about the last uh, year or so, I've been trying to push the methodology outside of free software. I've been really refining the process of how to work with people in a book sprint with um, less concrete material. There's a lot more work that needs to be put um, into trying to actually understand a scope together. You, you're really trying to mind map in a very organic, fluid way. It's largely a process of managing these people. You know, in open source they call them cat herders. You know, it's, it's like that. You have to do that not just with the people, but with the idea in a sense. You know, like you have to manage these people and the scope of the book um, together and sort of herd them towards having a final product. It's very important that right at the beginning that there is no pre-production. So if you try and write a table of contents virtually through various remote technologies, when people actually come to sit down and look at the book and look at the table of contents, they're usually quite confused because they actually haven't had the kind of rich discussion that they all need to be able to understand what was in that person's head when that particular person um, wrote that table of contents or included that particular item. So you really need to have everybody in the same room. And when they're in the same room, it's a facilitator's job to, um, to you know, let them feel a little bit of nervous anxiety about you know, whether they actually can do this. Um, but also to give them confidence in the process. Um, and by doing that, you really need to have very, very strong facilitation. So you have to get it in front of a group of people who have never met you before and convince them that you're going to lead them from where they are now, which is feeling anxious, through to a completed published book in five days, which to them is, you know, sounds a bit crazy. There are a lot of tricks in between um, starting the book sprint and the end of it, of course, and this is this is what I would sort of call, you know, the methodology. It's um, all the all the tricks and the processes of facilitating people and content. When I first started this, I thought it would be very difficult to um, to keep people working long hours. You know, the long hours that you need in order to produce a book in a short time. But actually, what I find is that um, you can't stop people working. You know. People love the book sprint process so much. Once they get started, the energy is just going. I mean, imagine being in a room with people who share a passion for the same topic that you do. You know, five days, and that's all you're focused on. I mean, it's a very, very rewarding, a very rich experience for those people. I want there to be um, a much better uh, methodology. The methodology is embryonic. Um, it needs to be developed and explored and documented. There needs to be more facilitators. So far, uh, you know, I'm the only person really facilitating book sprints. There's a few other people that have tried it. Um, but, you know, it's a very, very powerful um, process. And there should be, simply, there should be more people um, making use of this. The last thing is that I really feel that um, unless um, there's real time spent in developing the book sprint methodology um, for free culture and keeping it as an open methodology, I really have this um, concern that this process might be um, turned into a proprietary process um, by other organizations. It really needs to have um, a lot of energy put into it to develop it and to keep it open.